It's taken a community effort to care for all of them. Last week, nearly 200 dogs were rescued from what investigators call horrible conditions at a Laurel County home. The county's animal shelter didn't have room for all the dogs, so they were taken to the Laurel County Fairgrounds. But today, some of those dogs were brought here to Lexington. Hillary Thornton has an update new at 6. A special Christmas Eve delivery at the Lexington Humane Society. Welcome to Lexington. 14 dogs arriving from Laurel County, all here to find their forever homes. Recently had a hoarding case and um, totally inundated. Last week, state police took 178 dogs from the home of Stephanie Fields, director of Homeward Bound. Sending the loads of dogs to the Laurel County Animal Shelter, a shelter only able to house 32 dogs, leading to a temporary setup inside of a pavilion at the fairgrounds. Even though the Lexington Humane Society is already near capacity, workers here say when they saw what was happening in Laurel County, they knew they had to help. You can see how excited they're they were coming off the truck. They all have those wagging tails. They're happy to be here, and we're happy that we're able to provide such a loving, caring place for them. A fresh start for these dogs as they enter the shelter to find plenty of love and the proper care. Going to be fixed, so either spayed or neutered, vaccinated, up to date on all their vaccinations as of today, and microchip. So we do put in quite a bit of money to each individual animal. We also, if animals come into us with medical, um, we're going to do anything we can. While some could not contain their excitement, others calmly took in the new place they will be staying, all showing love and affection for those giving a chance. Better than where he works. Good dog. In Lexington, Hillary Thornton, WKYT. Now, workers with the Humane Society say while they took in this load of dogs, their donations are actually down this year. And we have more information on how you can help on our website. Just check out WKYT.com.